welcome back to my YouTube channel. So guys, I have not said that in so long. It's been over a month since I've recorded a video and now I'm back because you know when Love Island is back, I have to come back and we've got to get these reviews out, guys. So guys, before I get into this video, please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. You already know Road to 20K. All right, guys, let's get it popping. Okay, overall this season's looking all right. It's looking all right, it's looking all right. But guys, let's start into it. Okay, boom. We see Ruchi and Jess come in first. Now Jess is 22. I feel like sometimes I feel like every single year somebody is lying about their ages. I'm not gonna lie. Anyways, um, she wants to have kids, she wants to um get married. She's saying she's from London. Guys, that baby's from Romford. You know that I'm sorry, it's, it's not it's not like the baby's from Romford, and even still, like the whole Range Rover Mum thing, guys. If you don't know a lot of girls like or women that look like her have that like they will drive a range rover and they'll have their kids and you know they're like a yummy mommy like that's what she gives and i love that that's what she wants because that's exactly what she gives um ruchi um i quite like her she's 24 years old i like her energy this is why again i'm not gonna lie i don't know when these people are gonna let me rest about this whole personality thing i don't want to sound like a broken record but these people sound like a broken record um Ruchi was saying that she likes guys that are tall and that like dress well, but you said personality. People that got bad fashion taste can have nice personality, but no, it's not about that. Well, it is about that, but the first thing is about looks, guys. Come on, it's about the looks because many dress is okay, right? And he's tall, right? But the, the chemistry is not giving. So we see them, okay, cool, cool, cool. They come into the villa. Of course, we always see the same gender enter the house or enter the villa each time. But like I said, let's mix things up. Let's switch things up. Um, and then Mitchell comes in. He's 26 and he's a plumber. It makes sense. But why, my thing is, what difference does it make having mixed gender? Like, I understand it's something different, but is it different for different sake? Or is it just... Or is there a difference? Like, what difference does it make? I don't, I'm not quite sure, but maybe we'll, we'll, we'll see. And then we have Andre. Now, the way he said his name at first, I'm like, baby boy rest, yeah? Baby boy rest. But the man actually got an apostrophe above the E, so you know what I mean? And then he said he's Portuguese, he's 21 years old. Honestly, guys, I'm not going to lie. And I, guys, please don't hate me for saying this. I prefer to go back to Bunda. Because Bam Bam... Bum bum, bum bum can go where in the bin. <laughs> That's the first one of the season, guys. I'm sorry, I would prefer Bunda. Sorry, Nyash, I'll take Nyash. And, and bum bum, at, at our age, okay, I'm not 21, but at your age, baby boy, it's not giving, it's actually not giving. But, um, he seems like he's gonna be trouble, even though. Towards the end of it, he seems a bit more laid back. But I think, of course, it's only episode one. I think more will come out of him. Then we see Ella. And Ella's 23 years old. And she's saying she wants to be a player. I don't think she's going to be a player. It was interesting because when she said what her type was, baby girl said dark skin. And I said, hang on a minute. I don't even think I've ever heard that term even be referenced on this show called Love Island. Let alone someone say that's their type. I was like okay like okay i was here for him um again andre is another one saying that he lacks personality but then he said he likes ella so what do you like about ella because you don't you just know her name so what you like about her it's her face it's the body that's what you like but okay let's move on so then they were talking about how the public were voting um but guys, I was still trying to figure out where my notification. Now, to be thinking about it, how can I have a notification when I ain't got that? I said, hang on a minute, so. But I need to publicize it more. Like, honestly, I need to publicize it more. And then my sister checked and it was actually on the Instagram page. So I was like, okay, so maybe it's my fault. But anyways, to be fair, guys, I'm not gonna lie. The way people got paired up, you guys need to let me know if you guys would do it different. That's what I really wanna know. Okay, so let's start into it. George, now guys, let me just start off by saying first and foremost, George used to go where? In the bin. ITV, ITV, ITV. How many times did I call your name? Why is this guy still on the show? First of all, y'all don't never know how to do no due diligence, yeah? In, 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 in the mix up of everything that's going on with Philip Schofield and all this type of stuff, y'all trying to do this mix up right now. Right now. 
ITV, clean up your act, yeah? Because if it's the way the man's getting pied off, maybe he'll be gone in, in a couple of days. But realistically speaking, should he have even, like, you guys could have cut him out of the seat. Mm, I don't really know about the ITV. I've got my eyes on you because I don't know what you're doing right here. Anyways, he is 24 years old and he's a salesman. I'm not, that's exactly what he gives. You know, like those type of men that act, you know, like there's a those type of women that act dumb. He's one of those men that act dumb. Or maybe he really is dumb. I don't really know. But he doesn't give. He thinks he's a cheeky chappy. It's not giving. Like, I think he's, you know what I mean? Inflated ego. The things are not lining up. The things are not matching up. Um, <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> Adios. Anyways, he gets coupled up with Jess, and I'm not gonna lie, that's exactly who I would have paired him up with. If I was voting, I would have given him Jess 1000%. So I thought that was a the good voting. Okay, boom. Then we get Molly. She says she's 21. I could I could BS. I'm sorry, that girl's not 21. I'm not saying how old I think she is, but she's not 20. Guys, what? I'm sorry. I'm older than her. I look younger than her. I'm just sorry. I just can't do it. 21. Again, she says she she's she's a farmer or something. Maybe the cow's done age though. I don't know. Anyway, he's a, no shade. No shade, guys. Um, chatty, 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 chatty. I think I could get behind her, but then she could be annoying. I, but at the moment, she's cool. I quite like her big personality. I like how much she talks. I like, um, yeah, she seems like she's going to be someone that's going to be a staple in the, in the villa. So good on her. Then we see Catherine, I don't know, and she gets paired with Mitchell. I would have paired them together. For me personally, them two make sense. To, them two make sense to me. Next one, Catherine. Come on, look at my baby girl from Dublin. Come on, Catherine, looking beautiful. Hair laid, beautiful, like just, just a beautiful girl. The skin's giving, everything's giving. Okay, cool. Of course, guys, who did she get paired with? Andre. Now, guys, this is my query. Answer me this. If not, no, lies, I just answer my own query. You know, you, you know when you think you're gonna answer a question that's gonna be really like, ooh, but then you answer your own question and so it's not really all. I personally would have paired her, as in Catherine, with Tariq. Is it Tariq or Tyreek? I can't remember. Ty Guys, don't drag me, but I'm gonna say Tariq for now. Um, I would have paired them together. Cause she needs some a bit more grown man-ish and no, 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 nothing to Andre, but, um, yeah, I mean, I want, I, I would prefer her to be with Tariq, for me personally, but she was paired with Andre. Now, guys, realistically speaking, if not, if it wasn't Tariq, I would have picked Andre. So, I understand, because I've seen it on Twitter, some people are like, no, no black love, no black love, no, nothing. Because some people just, because of course, sometimes you feel like you got to vote for those people, I mean, like, support those people by default, but I'm sorry, thankfully, I'm not afflicted with that. You guys saw last season, I'm not even going to bring it up, but I was not afflicted with that and I'm not going to be afflicted by that this year. Again, I'm going to go with who I like and if it happens to be two black people and then love it. If it's not, but all I know is that I'm supporting Catherine, so. That's, that's what I do now, but at the moment I think it makes sense. Um, even though I feel like Andre is too young. He's, too, he's 21 years, he's too young. But at the same time, I don't really get 21-year-old vibes, if I'm honest. But me, personally, I don't. I, I couldn't date someone that was younger than me. But anyways, moving on. Then we see Mehdi, 26 years old. Guys, the way that man sashayed in the house, the way this man said, I'm gone with the wind, fabulous. Guys, the way, boy, the way, mm, guys, the way he was dancing, mm, maybe he, maybe he's a dancer, guys. Maybe he's a dancer. Maybe he's a dancer, guys. The way, mm, again, such a small thing, but that entrance connected, okay? That entrance really, really connected. Um, but yeah, he's French. Guys, I'm not gonna lie. If you check this guy's Instagram page, there's a couple pictures that I was like, oh, damn. This. And then, I don't know, I feel like a lot of people are doing up editing pictures or they're doing up angles because I don't, he looks like some pictures, but then, okay, the pen's gone. He looks like some pictures, but then others he doesn't really look like. And I just think, mm, it's not really good. But anyways, he got paired with Ruchi, Ruchi, and she didn't look happy. She didn't look happy at all. I think, guys, it might have been the walk. I'm not even gonna, with all sincerity, with all due respect, it might have been the walk, child. Um, 
I don't know. And then we see Tariq, he's 24 years old, semi-professional footballer, like a mixed race guy with square head. Guys, the star kit, the Love Island starter kit, kit is here. Full effect. Summer has started, okay? Summer has started. Semi-professional, mixed race with a square head. Come on with a trim. It's Summer has, guys, welcome to Love Island 2023, period. Um, he's quite, I think he's quite attractive. Death in the right ear because so Love Island they're still doing up this, you know what I mean? Okay, they're, just, they're doing up diversity because I think technically, based on how these people are looking, this might be the, the most diverse starter islanders that I can recall. Yeah, I would, I would say so. Uh, me personally, I would say so. Um, and then what was I gonna say? And then da, 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 he got paired with Ella. Guys, come and see shame. Because remember when Kai last year was like, what, what was the girl's name? He called her something, but then he wasn't that girl. I can't remember what name he was, but he called her something. It was almost similar like that, even though she whispered it. Ella said to Tariq, don't you know me? Don't, oh, don't, haven't we met before? I think she said. He was like, have we? She was like, yeah. He was like, when? Oh, where? She was like, in London. She was like, not even that long ago. He was like, we'll talk about it later. Me personally, if someone didn't even act like they knew me, guys, I'm not gonna lie, I don't know you neither. I don't know you, I don't know you, I don't know you, I don't know you. As if you're not gonna come, come, come claim me. Excuse me, sir. So Tariq is already letting me know he belongs where? To the streets, yeah? To the streets. That man be in these streets. He don't even remember homegirl. But homegirl's like, how? Because in her head, he needs to remind me, like, I'm memorable. I think he's gonna be an inducted into the Destiny Childish. He fits the part, he looks the part, he might act the part, this might be his club. Um, also guys, going back to Medi quickly, why was French Montana trending? French Montana was really trending, like, y'all need to be so serious. Anyways, moving on, they now start having chats, the girls have the chats, the boys have the chats. Um, Ruchi is not interested in Medi, which is completely fine. Ella um, was explaining how my man knows her but at the same time it's like why are you so certain you knew him did you was there something memorable happen or is it because you think you're a bad b like which one is it but anyways um and then jess says she likes Tariq. she likes a bad boy so she don't like mr george um where 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 for george um and then do, 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 do. okay so medi and ruchi are having a conversation and guys the space between them is insane you could at least do a hundred meter sprint between the distance between them two again body language says it all then um i believe the girls are getting dressed and who is it jess says to everybody else uh, guys who, who 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 fancies george i think ruchi ends up laughing and nobody says nothing oh i think molly says i can't remember molly says some says some p some pc but it's like He's just not the guy. And it's so funny, he needs VT, oh, I'm this, I'm that. The, mm, it's the ones with the widest mouths that get embarrassed the most. <laughs> wah, 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 Mr. George. Anyways, um, so we see Tariq and Catherine speaking. Now, guys, even though I know Tariq is going to be problematic, that coupling I prefer. I prefer it. I get more energy. I get more vibes. I, I'm, it's, it's, it looks like it makes sense. The flirting, the... Mm -mm -mm, it looks like it makes sense guys i'm sorry i'm here for those two again if i just carry it to the side i know he's gonna mess her around because he gonna mess anybody around in my opinion i like the look of them too I, I i i'm feeling it way more than i'm feeling it with her and andre period then we see medi having a conversation with ella and it's funny because guys remember when we, when we always say these guys love blonde hair blue eyes medi is that in reverse he's doing reverse hairism if y'all get what i'm saying he is brunette brown brown eyes that's what he likes point blank period and he likes ella now it's funny ella don't really be saying anything for real people say they like her and she doesn't really give anything away um maybe it's because she also doesn't like them i don't know and then they start playing beer pong um mitchell kisses molly jess and ella the way ella said that boy's kiss was dead me personally I'll put myself in the bin because I can't nobody. There ain't no one. That, mm, why am I coming back? I'm not about to, why am I about to spill my own tea. Let me calm down. Anyways, guys, let me move on. 
Um, Tariq has to point out he's the biggest game player. Not a big game player. Not, not me lying. Sorry. Um, he's biggest competition, and he says Andre. Molly gets the same question, and she says um, Jess because they're both blonde. They end up doing a push up, but Jess, oh lord, Jess holds her strength somewhere else because it damn sure ain't in her arms. Anyways, um, Catherine kisses Andre and she kisses Tariq, and baby girl goes for it. I'm not gonna lie. Tariq looked like he was loving it. Andre, the way she grabbed the back of Andre's neck, oh baby girl. Oh baby. Okay, yeah, it's getting started. Um, Richie kisses Tariq and Andre. Now, this baby really does like tall, dark, and handsome. Okay, let's get into it, guys. Um, and then Maya comes out looking mm, scrumptious. Um, and she said, let's play a dare. She said, girls, if you're not comfortable, if you're not feeling this couple, step forward. Love it. Because let's start pushing people to start being honest quicker. Instead of, oh, 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 I can maybe act like, mm -mm. put them in positions where they could actually benefit from being bold love that so then um jess and ruchi step forward and they both basically say that they don't have chemistry or physical attraction to medi and george so then a new guy comes in guys i'm not gonna lie if i close my eyes that man don't look like how he looks if i close my eyes that man don't look like what am i supposed to look like in my at least in my head what i would think but yeah the man is from southwest london big up southwest london for me he reminds me of like if adam collard was from southwest london he would be he would be somewhat like that especially wasn't he a pt as well i think he i think he is actually a pt so this man's name is zachary me personally this is not a bummy me personally i'm gonna have to i'm have to step back to medi i'm not even gonna lie still um <laughs> because mm, i'm all right um skipping can the real slim shady please stand up um yeah not 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 really for me but i like the challenge i like them trying to switch up things i'm like them trying to bring something a bit more interesting bring something a bit more fresh and actually bring some ooh, ooh, ah to the situation um so yeah i think the episode seems good i'm happy that this review i think is under 20 minutes long thank god guys i'm gonna try and make my reviews concise because even i ain't got time guys work is so busy but also something i want to mention ella if you you know I mean? your ex looks like this person your ex sounds like this person at this point go back to your ex like baby <laughs> um yeah but there's no tomorrow night of course because it's only the second episode um i'm intrigued to see what's going to happen i'm glad that people are are, are not like people are not hold down well molly and mitchell no mitchell might be held down to molly but i feel like molly if she found someone better i think she has the propensity to <laughs> turn her head and i like the fact that most of the other couples are still very much so open and nobody married off yet let's keep it open let's keep it light let's keep it fresh <clears throat> let's do the that let's let's do what we're supposed to be doing but guys and uh, thank you for watching this video please don't forget to like comment and subscribe you know i really appreciate it and i'll see you in my next episode